Hey guys, welcome to another commentary done by Diggity. This is BSL 16 Hasu League, round of 32, group F, bottom right in corner. We got CD Fire. CD Fire. I also want to say Cider, but CD Fire. As the orange Protoss, bottom left in corner, we got Erob once again. Starting as the red Protoss, this is going to be on Radeon, which, if you have not seen it in ASL and on the ladder and other places, it's a, it's a fun map. Natural expansion, the. Feels like they're obligatory eggs right now, so it's like a little bit wider down the line, nearby third with uh, entryway. It's not from high ground to low ground like a lot of the other maps. And then uh, an expansion here at the six with less gas. What I find interesting is, is these are less attractive than grabbing expansions at exterior bases that have the, f like every base has a gas. So why would you, these, I almost feel like these are the trick bases to take, right? It's like only go for those if you're cheesing so that, because who would expect you to do that? Especially bottom left to bottom right, you don't want to expand into your opponent in most instances, unless you're, I don't know, really thinking about getting instantly aggressive after your follow-up and building gateways on site for some reason. <clears throat> anyway, it is a ramped map. Looks like we are going to see at least a gateway opener here. That does, the four player aspect does open up the possibility of 12 Nexus which I have seen recently uh, in PvP out here in Hasu League land. It looks like we got Gateway on both ends this time, though. Upper right in corner, Scout for Z uh, CD Fire. Erob going for the cross map Scout. He's like, this little, did he catch the, port? oh, so checking the middle. That was interesting. Checked middle, w moved bottom right, but did not see the probe in, in the meantime. And so he's going to end up with first Scout, but kind of cute there but doesn't reveal anything else. And it looks like it is going to be a 10-12 uh, gate for ZD, uh, CD fire. Scouted out from Erob, so it'll be up to him. We'll see how his micro, done. He, uh, micro goes. He opened up a simulator cybernetic score. He is queuing up an initial zealot. We'll see how heavy a dedication it is as well. Oftentimes players will just go Vespin Geyser and then uh, sometimes just go the three zealot. Initial three zealots to see what damage they can do pull out from there. Seems to be like the thing that just Protoss do these days. Like the bread and butter build. The bread and butter build. It used to be like two gate robo into expansion. That used to be like the, the like, this is the one. Oh, hey, look, it has the BSL. I didn't notice that before. Worker gets wiped out there. I wonder if it was ASL before and this is like the special map for it. But that's cute. I, I hadn't seen that before. Anyway. Worker sneaking his way in. We also have... An initial dragoon being built. It is important to take out that worker just in case they provide they turn around and provide that little bit of extra DPS. Three zealots making their way across. We'll keep an eye on that gas. We'll just click we'll do this. We'll click there. And then we'll click away and we'll see. Does it show us that it gets capped? Does it turn to a simulator if you want? Okay, look at that. Turned into a simulator. So today we learned. So it looks like it's just going to be the three zealot that it, well, never mind. We got two additional zealots here. So five zealot dedication here to start. The Dragoon getting a, a pretty late start out here. Might even want to stay on the low ground. And force that Zelt to engage down here. That initial Zelt's actually taking a considerable amount of damage. This probe trying to sneak off the line to provide some support. First Zelt taken out pretty decently. Are these three going to try to hold the ramp though? Looks like they're going to try to hold the ramp. The Zelt microing his way back. Dragoon taking attack of damage, but the second Dragoon spawning right there. Pretty solid defense from Erob thus far. Honestly, looking solid. And ooh, getting a tack of damage. He's honestly playing much, much better than the previous match. And great micro all the way around these elves. We, and we still got two more incoming. But thus far, he's managed to basically take no probe damage. Very little. Well, he's taken some damage on this Dragoon. The Dragoon hasn't gotten really touched. He's managed to keep his probe count high. And now we got four Dragoons out, which is more than enough to... Wipe out the counterattack force. And CD Fire noticing that he's like, okay, I didn't take out anything. And because I will, went the five zealot dedication, I'm worried about the counterattack. So let me just GG right here. So quick win from Erob, well deserved with, the, with some slick micro. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for listening.